what is going on guys what is going on welcome back to learn crypto my name is nick helman aka the crypto hitman and make sure to like share and subscribe to this channel and this video if you like daily updates on not only crypto but also stock technical analysis fundamental analysis and news the video today is going to be an update to my last video pertaining to what is going on with bitcoin the coinbase stock micro strategy stock and riot stock and then we'll see where my brain and tangents lead us for this video as well check out my previous videos and from the past check out my partner's video todd butterfield he did an in-depth live show yesterday looking at various charts and requested charts let's jump right into it so what do we got going on today bitcoin after the video i was saying we were looking pretty toppy we had this massive drawdown here massive drawdown it wasn't huge. We were live. I did the video during this time period. It fell, you know, two and a half percent. Nothing too, nothing too crazy. But we are seeing a little bit of a rally today. Why are we rallying today? Why did we catch ourselves? Well, we have this moving average here. This is a super strong area of support. This rectangle. The the worst case scenario goal is to hold this white uptrend line, like I talked about the other day. But we had some good inflation news, which is making these stocks very strong. You see the Nasdaq is up 200 right now. This is the high of the day. S&P is up 46. Dow is up 368. These are all on the highs of the day, which is dragging Bitcoin higher as well. Now, if stocks are up and Bitcoin is up, what do you think is going on with Coinbase stock, MicroStrategy stock, and Riot? They're all getting some relief rallies as well. Now, we talked about this live. I drew this live. We had this rally here. I said I'm looking for... Coinbase to sell off once again and get into this zone, this 0.5 to 0.618 Fib levels. I would love to be able to buy in here, but we might not get the opportunity. You know, this this green line is up here. I said if we give above 90, 91 dollars, it's probably going to force my hand and go long once again on Coinbase. Now this isn't the greatest entry. We do have some bullish signals. We see the RSI back to neutral with the with the bullish cross. Uh, we see, you know, Coinbase put in a higher low here. We see that it did bounce strongly off the 50% Fib level here. All bullish signals. But the reason I wouldn't mind getting back in is because that would be us buying about 14.5% cheaper than our sell. We sold at 105.67-ish over at patreon.com slash learn crypto. If you want live trades, you want 24-7 access to myself and Todd Butterfield, you want to be able to ask us any question you want, beginner to advanced, and get an answer directly from us, join patreon.com slash learn crypto. It's a dollar a day, guys. A dollar a day. One trade pays for it for a year. We have so many members that pay a full year. If you pay a year, you also get a 10% discount. It's like 400 bucks for an entire year. That's one trade. Anyways, we are seeing the rally here because Bitcoin is up, stocks are up and with the bullish uh, inflation numbers, but still not to our buy level. So right now we're doing nothing. If it gets above this 91 level, we got to force into a long, but we're hoping it can meander down and get us into here where I would blindly buy anywhere in the zone because we see this moving average coming up to the zone. We see this as a strong FIB level for both Wyckoff and FIB extensions, and we sold it so much higher. This would be buying it back, you know, between... 22 to 28 percent cheaper than our sell and if we did meander off that means this rsi is going to have the bearish cross and get back down here to oversold like it did at these levels giving us many indicators on why we should buy we are getting close i'm assuming micro strategy and riot are looking very similar let's go over here and take a look micro strategy me and todd were on the phone while this low was being put in we just couldn't pull the trigger because we saw this lower level 200 ma we weren't quite oversold on his Wyckoff indicators. And this is kind of the line I drew during the live show. Uh, it marked the exact high of the day, you can see here. And I was hoping it kind of would meander down into these levels. You can see we are right at where we sold MicroStrategy for our last trade. I think this last trade was something like a 25% gainer given live at patreon.com slash line crypto. Yeah, it was like 25.5% gainer. And we're sitting at that level here still. I would love if this thing could meander off. You know, Bitcoin has this little bit of a surge. Stocks sell off later in the day. Bitcoin has a little bit of a drop and it drags these to some red bars. And we want to be long on these crypto sector stock plays. As you know, MicroStrategy own, owns almost 1% of all the Bitcoin that will ever exist. And they are a software company as well. So I think they're going to continue to produce some software that benefits the Bitcoin and crypto ecosystem. As that's the direction they're kind of going. And then the last one I wanted to give the update on was Riot. Riot, we did sell at a lower level for profits at 1545. That one kept running. A little bit early sell, but profits are profits. And this thing had the same thing. Big wick. We have this relief rally. I drew this line 
right when I was doing the video last a couple days ago. Look, that ended up being the exact high. And I, I put this line down to here because this would be at some support levels. And then also you have the 200 moving average coming up. We still have no bullish cross here on the RSI. We did put in a higher low, but that doesn't mean much. And then downside support is in this, you know, 14 to $13 range between the 200 MA and this previous highs over here that you can see on the chart. This one is not rebounding near as well as Coinbase or MicroStrategy. This is a Bitcoin miner. So a little bit harder because difficulty is high. Profit margins are down. Plus they earn revenue in bitcoin so in order to pay bills sometimes you got to sell bitcoin and when the bitcoin price is down here not getting very much bang for your buck so if this one sells off again maybe gives us a bullish divergence and comes into the support level on this 200 moving average that's when we'll be going long that's really about all i wanted to cover in this video you know check out my twitter for some other updates you know we we called on the xrp pump to sell that 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 was going to be you know the highest level since march of 2022 after the court ruled it was not a security this initial pump and relisting by exchanges. Remember, I got relisted on Coinbase and Kraken and some of these other ones. Will just be exit liquidity. Whales and long-term holders need to cash out their bags. Well, that was at like 90 cents, 95 cents, whatever the high was. And right now, I think we're sitting at something like 63 cents. So that was a good call, 63 and a half cents. Uh, Todd did take a trade on this at 66, so slightly down on the trade. But again, we didn't FOMO into this rally. We said to sell any XRP you had, and then Todd gave a buy. I'll mark it on here just so I have it at 66 cents just a couple days ago i think it was on august 1st i could be wrong yep it was the low of the day on august 1st that's what we're thinking that's what we're doing um stay tuned i'm gonna be having more videos posted today we have a patreon first video that means in the discord group people can ask any questions they want i compile those questions i make a video give it to patreon first then i'll upload it to you guys over here at youtube and twitter um, and then I also have a sponsorship announcement video about a project that I think is in a really good place. They just gave out their testnet tokens, so there's a bit of a sell-off. Plus, I have the insider scoop on the updates that are coming soon, maybe expanding the new network. So stay tuned for those two videos. I think you're going to get a lot of alpha out of them. And stay tuned for when we go long on these uh, Coinbase, on MicroStrategy, on Riot, on Bitcoin. And if you want to know exactly where our buys are, where our sells are, where our stops are, join us at patreon.com slash learn crypto. And until next time, guys, stay tuned for your daily updates right here at Learn Crypto.